Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Luminous Gaming. I'm your host Tom Roberts and today you're getting your 5 minute fix and everything you need to know about The Last of Us. The Last of Us is an action-adventure survival horror video game developed by Naughty Dog and published by Sony Computer Entertainment. It was released for the PlayStation 3 worldwide on June 14th, 2013. Players control Joel, a smuggler tasked with escorting a teenage girl named Ellie across a post-apocalyptic United States. The Last of Us is played from a third-person perspective. Players use firearms and improvised weapons and can use stealth to defend against hostile humans and cannibalistic creatures infested by a mutated strain of a deadly fungus. In 2013, an outbreak of a mutated deadly fungus ravages the United States, transforming its human hosts into cannibalistic monsters known as the infected. So let's jump in into today's five minute fix and obviously this is a spoiler warning. In the suburbs of Austin, Texas, Joel flees the chaos with his brother Tommy and daughter Sarah. As they flee, Sarah is shot by a soldier and dies in Joel's arms. In the 20 years that follow, most of civilization is destroyed by the infection. Survivors live in heavily policed quarantine zones, independent settlements and nomadic groups. Joel works as a smuggler with his partner Tess in the quarantine zone in the north end of Boston. They hunt down Robert, a black market dealer, to recover a stolen weapons cache. Before Tess kills him, Robert reveals that he traded the cache with the Fireflies, a rebel militia opposing the quarantine zone authorities. The leader of the Fireflies, Marlene, promises to double their cash in return for smuggling a teenage girl, Ellie, to the Fireflies hiding in the Massachusetts State House outside the quarantine zone. Joel, Tess and Ellie sneak out into the night, but after an encounter with a patrol, they discover Ellie is infected. Full infection normally occurs in under two days, but Ellie claims she was infected three weeks ago and that her immunity may lead to a cure. The trio make their way to their destination through hordes of the infected, but find that the fireflies there have been killed. Tess reveals that she's been bitten by an infected. Believing in Ellie's importance, Tess sacrifices herself against pursuing soldiers so Joel and Ellie can escape. Joel decides to find Tommy, a former firefly, in the hope that he can locate the remaining fireflies. With the help of Bill, a smuggler who owes Joel a favour, they acquire a working vehicle. Driving into Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, Joel and Ellie are ambushed by bandits and their car is wrecked. They ally with two brothers, Henry and Sam. After they escape the city, Sam is bitten by an infected, but hides it from the group. As his infection takes hold, Sam attacks Ellie, but Henry shoots him dead and commits suicide out of grief. In the fall, Joel and Ellie find Tommy in Jackson, Wyoming, where he has assembled a fortified settlement near a hydroelectric dam with his wife, Maria. Joel contemplates leaving Ellie with Tommy, but after she confronts him about Sarah, he decides to let her stay with them. Tommy directs them to a Fireflies M cave at the University of Eastern Colorado. They find the university abandoned, but learn that the Fireflies have moved on to a hospital in Salt Lake City, Utah. Afterward, Joel is severely wounded by bandits who are killed by Ellie. During the winter, Ellie and Joel shelter in the mountains. Joel is on the brink of death and relies on Ellie to care for him. Hunting for food, Ellie encounters David and James, scavengers willing to trade medicine for food. David turns hostile after revealing the university bandits were part of his group. Ellie manages to lead David's group away from Joel, but is eventually captured. David intends to recruit her into his cannibal group. Refusing the offer, she escapes after killing James, but David corners her in a burning restaurant. Meanwhile, Joel recovers from his wounds and sets out to find Ellie. He reaches Ellie as she kills David and breaks down crying. Joel comforts her before they flee. In the spring, Joel and Ellie arrive in Salt Lake City and are captured by a firefly patrol. In the hospital, Marlene tells Joel that Ellie is being prepared for surgery. In the hope of producing a vaccine for the infection, the fireflies must remove the infected portion of Ellie's brain. Unwilling to let Ellie die, Joel battles his way to the operating room and carries the unconscious Ellie to the parking garage. He is confronted by Marlene, whom he shoots and kills to prevent the fireflies from pursuing them. On the drive out of the city, Joel claims that the Fireflies have found many other immune people but were unable to create a cure and that they had stopped trying. On the outskirts of Tommy's settlement, Ellie reveals that she was not alone when she was infected and expresses her survivor guilt. 
At her insistence, Joel swears that his story about the fireflies is true. The Last of Us received critical acclaim. Review website Metacritic calculated an average score of 95 out of 100, indicating universal acclaim. It's the fifth highest rated PlayStation 3 game on Metacritic. Reviewers praise the character development, story and subtext, visual and sound design, and depiction of female and LGBT characters. The Last of Us is considered one of the most significant titles of the seventh generation of video games and has been included among the greatest video games of all time. Colin Moriarty of IGN called The Last of Us a masterpiece and PlayStation 3's best exclusive. Ollie Welsh of Eurogamer wrote that it's a beacon of hope for the survival horror genre and Andy Kelly of Computer and Video Games declared it as Naughty Dog's finest moment. So that was your five minute fix and everything you need to know about The Last of Us. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe, hit that like button and leave us a comment below of your next five minute fix. So you've been watching Luminous Gaming, I'm your host Tom Roberts, see you on the next video.